We know them as the stars of the hit war drama Band of Brothers. They were the paratroopers of Easy Company, 2nd Battalion, 506th Parachute Infantry Regiment, 101st Airborne Division. Easy was the 2nd Battalion's main attack force, and they were no ordinary men. Out of 500 who signed up for intensive training at Camp Tokua, only 148 made the flight to Normandy. Heavy anti-aircraft fire shot down their headquarters, killing their commander and separating them from their units. Their first mission upon landing was to capture four 105mm howitzers at Braycourt Manor, firing at Utah Beach. But there was one glitch in the plan. Their newly appointed commander, Richard Winters, had only a dozen men with him. Fortunately, Winters had studied war tactics well. Through a strategic attack via trenches with the support of a platoon from Dog Company, they defeated the 60-man garrison, captured the howitzers, and found a map of all the machine guns in the area. If not for their bravery, countless more would have died on Utah Beach that day. During the Battle of Corentin, they were the last company standing against severe enemy fire. Then, two men from the first platoon charged forward and took out a panzer tank with a bazooka, buying them time as the other companies regrouped. On September 17th, they parachuted into Holland for Operation Market Garden. The drop zones were positioned so far away that it took them hours to reach their targets. Just as they reached the bridge over the Wilhelmina River, it blew up, delaying their mission with disastrous consequences. Fast forward to December 16th, Easy Company was back in action for the Battle of the Bulge. They braved the freezing winter without proper winter clothing to secure the perimeter of Bastogne, setting up defensive lines where other soldiers said it would be impossible to remain standing. On their way to the town of Foy, a tremendous barrage of rockets, mortars, and artillery exploded around them, and they had to dig foxholes and packed snow as fast as they could to survive. But despite all odds, they held their positions until General Patton's 3rd Army could arrive. Their last mission was to capture Hitler's Eagle's Nest.